Hi, my name is Taylor Allen, and for my creative project, I did a paper on Homer's story, The Odyssey. I chose this um, topic because the story was very interesting to me, and I'm very interested in Greek mythology and literature. So it was very significant that I chose this form of literature to research and write a paper on as my creative project. The Odyssey is an epic poem set in Greek history describing a 20-year journey of King Odysseus. The Odyssey author Homer was a very influential writer of his time. With two great stories, one being the Odyssey and the other the Iliad, his writings had a great influence on Renaissance culture in Italy. The Odyssey contained Western ideas which Homer included. Due to Homer's writings, he ins his influences he influences many other up and coming artists to contribute their own literature. The story of the Odyssey begins in the middle, where Odysseus is still traveling home, but he encounters many diversions. That instead of traveling a few months, his journey ends up taking nearly twenty years to get to his family in Ithaca. Why at home, Odysseus' son Telemachus tries to search for his father, War Mace, to help his mother Penelope and takes back his home where many suitors were trying to court Odysseus' wife and to marry one of them. There are many characters that play a significant role in the story of the Odyssey. Odysseus is favored by the goddess Athena, fought in the Trojan War, and was returning from war to his kingdom in Ithaca. In Homer's version, he portrays Odysseus as a very persistent and courageous character. In many problems Odysseus encountered, he showed great wisdom and courage. The delays in his journey were caused by Poseidon, god of sea. Poseidon contributed to long journey, contributed to the long journey by having him to wander between Troy and Ithaca, but never returning home until the very end. Odysseus encountered the Lotus Eaters, Polythemius, the Cyclops, and others, where he showed great courage in saving himself and his men. Penelope, one of the characters in the Odyssey, Odysseus' wife and queen of Ithaca, was a very clever individual who tricked off her suitors for three years. She, devoted, she was a devoted wife to her husband and mother to her son Telemachus. During Odysseus' departure, she encountered, encountered a raid of her home by suitors who were demanding her to marry them. The suitors ravaged and invaded her home. With no protection, she had to figure out a way to hold them off. For three years, she held off her suitors, weaving a shrew for her father's funeral, her father-in-law's funeral. She tells her suitor that when she is done weaving, then she would choose a suitor to marry. During the day, she would weave the shrew, and at night, she would unravel it. This continued for three years, until one of her servants betrayed her by revealing her plan to one of the suitors. Once her plan failed, she conned up another way to suspect. She conned up another way. She suspected that one of the beggars was Odysseus. She plays, plans a contest for her hand in marriage by holding a contest to see who can shoot an arrow through a bunch of axes and who can hold the great bow of Odysseus. Which is a trick she knows only Odysseus can do. Penelope not only was clever, but Homer displayed her much courage and devotion to her husband. Telemachus, son of Odysseus and Penelope, was displayed as a young man who was trying to save his mother and take back his father's kingdom. <clears throat> Telemachus tries to help by calling all of Ithaca's leaders to help him rid of the suitors that were invading his father's kingdom. He is unsuccessful, but he gets help from the goddess of war, Athena. She helps guide him to seek help from his father and comrades who fought with him during the Trojan War. She guides him in how to act amongst the Greek leaders. While there, he learns that Millennius. While there, he learns that Millennius, that his father, Millennius tells Telemachus that his father is still alive and being held captive. Athena shows protection to Telemachus against the suitors, 
who were overtaking his home. Once united with his father, Telemachus stands with him to fight off the suitors, winning his father's trust and respect. Athena, goddess of war, plays an important role in the story of the Odyssey. Odysseus is favored by her because she helps guide and protect him and his family. In the story of the Odyssey, the Greek gods are known for interfering with human lives. Athena helps guide Odysseus' son Telemachus by guiding him through his journey from an immature boy to a respected prince. Athena intervenes many times to help Odysseus in times of distress. As a result of the loyalty between Odysseus and Athena, she helps Telemachus gain his own glory, which helps him and his father fight off the suitors and gain their kingdom back. The Odyssey gives great adventure and displays heroism throughout many characters in the epic poem. The story was written in 725 between 725 and 765 BCE and is still being taught in many school curriculums. Originally written in Homeric hexameter, which is a certain dialect, has been rewritten and performed for many centuries. Uh, thank you for watching my video. Um, I was excited to share my creative way of describing the Odyssey. I mainly did a breakdown of certain characters in the story and I hope you enjoyed it.